a welterweight matchup between Nate Diaz and Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Well, no surprise, the Scotiabank Arena packed to the nines. These Canadians just have an insatiable appetite for it. Every time there's a fight in the north, the arena is completely full. And tonight, you see the same thing. I cannot wait for a great fight. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Oh, lands the double jab. Those are going to start to take their effect. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Visibly limping here. So both guys landing it well here. Good action early. That shot is blocked by Diaz. So just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Well, now if you're the opponent, you really got to be careful as Diaz is able to find a home for that right hand yet again. When Diaz starts landing the right hand, you have got to stay firm. You have got to dig your heels in the ground and say, no way you're going to just run me over. Easier said than done when you're facing Nathan Diaz. Oh, and he comes nice through with knee. a big knee. Single collar tie there. Oh, good opportunity to do damage here. He's got that tie clinch. Well, how about this striking display tonight as he lands yet another knee right there. Several have already landed in this round, and you can see their oh. He needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got a component for very bad. Effective utilization of the ground and down here by Diaz. Shots. Big ball for punch lands. Now we get back to range. Oh, high level defense there. The hook shot is blocked by Gamebred. Right on the button. Just misses with that one. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Oh, he slipped well there to avoid the left hand coming back. Very tricky to show that body kick. Oh, that is a killer jab there for Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Big picture might be the best boxer on this roster. I mean, he may just be the best boxer on this roster. From Miami, Florida, Cuban heritage. Oh! Final seconds of round one. Big knee to the body. Five minutes down. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get to it. Round two now. Nate Diaz. You ready? And Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Massive head kick. Oh, nice jab. Leg kick checked effectively there by Diaz. Oh, big elbow. Oh, he connects there. on the right hand. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those legs in. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen.
and gentlemen, crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 23 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Nate Dila. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in and...